want to go back to our breaking news about that school threat in Woodbridge today. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland just got on the scene. Matt, what have you learned? Hey, Kara, I want you to take a look here at the scene here at Amity Regional High School in Woodbridge. You can see all the cars here uh, lining the driveway and the roads leading up to the school as parents are coming to pick up their kids. Uh, what we've learned was that a threat was made uh, earlier. Uh, the staff here at Amity sending out uh, a, a, a letter to the uh, high school community saying that they had received an email this morning that contained a threatening message. We've learned that that threat was that there was going to be a shooting here at the school at noontime. Uh, obviously, police are here. They're investigating school staff as well, but uh, still uh, a lot of families when they heard uh, that there was a threat to the school, seeing a lot of parents come to pick up their kids as well. Uh, police, again, feeling that the school is safe, uh, but a number of uh, families uh, decided to pick up their kids and, and get them out of school here uh, early this afternoon. But uh, again, uh, a report of a threat here for Amity High School here in Woodbridge. Uh, but police are on scene uh, after a threat was made uh, early this morning. Of course, we're going to stay on this uh, story. And we're going to have more from you coming up tonight on Eyewitness News at 4 and 5. Though for now, we're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Woodbridge. Matt McFarland, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.